Hello all and welcome to episode 4 of the Extreme Randomized Nuzlocke Pokemon Red Version. Brought to you by me, Mr. Houndoomer. Today the goal is to be making it through Mount Moon, which was the goal for last time, but did not make it. And the repel wore off. Not a great start. Got a full team of six. And actually one extra, which is nice. Especially so early in the game. The battle guy over here. Yes, okay, okay. We are good there. No! Darn you, Charmeleon. You should have shown up first. I do not remember what this thing has. No! Okay, 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 okay. We're good. Ah, oh, that was so scary. My Ardeus life, life flashed before my eyes. It wasn't a very long flash. But it was something. <clears throat> yeah, in case you want to do that again, I'm pretty sure Gas can take that. No. No jump kick. Oh no, it exploded again. Okay, yeah, good, good, good. Cause gas is tough. Okay, I do not know how well the commentary is gonna be for this episode. I just got up a little bit ago. Like, not even an hour ago. So my voice probably sounds a little weird. I am not fully awake. So, great time to record, right? I thought so too. So, on the way through Mount Moon, to go beat up some kids on a bridge, get some gold. Weird, weird Pokemon. I like Execute, though. Why is it- Oh, no. No, 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 no. No Thunderbolt. No, no, no. Okay, okay. Um, you should be able to kill. Alright, Ardeus. Ardeus, Ardeus. It's Ardeus, it's Ardeus, it's Ardeus. It's Ardeus, it's Ardeus, it's Ardeus. Oh, oh, oh. Trainer. Oh, it's Ardeus. Big. You're not even very far into the cave yet. A cleat fairy. Hmm. I don't trust that. Gonna switch out to Nada. By the way, in between, I did actually look up to see when Noddle was supposed to learn a new attack. And it was level 29. So there is 13 more levels for Noddle to survive in order to learn a new move. Unless I can find a TM that it can learn. Level 10 Ardeus. Oh, gloom. So that's not exciting, but I mean, it kind of is what it is. Hopefully not, will get there. Probably not in this episode. But maybe in the next. Maybe in the one after that. I don't know. Maybe it'll die before then. Now I'm getting sad. Don't want to think about that. Oh, jeez. That is not good. Alright. Come on, Stu. No, Stu. Bad. 
Alright. This might be risky, but we're going for it. Come on, Steve. Yes! And doozy level 11. Oh, I was hoping Stu would get level 2. You guys are not giving me very much money. Like, I, I need more money. Because I need to buy stuff. And you are just... Just not... Not doing it very well. You need to be rich so you can give me a lot of money. Because I really need repels right now. I do not want to deal with any more exploding charmeleons. And that is why. You know, I don't get much points for that. It might be better just to run from those. It probably is. Ratata! Hmm, I wonder what Ratata has. We shall never know. Because it is dead. Oh, this is the area I thought I was in earlier. TM21, okay. Come on, move for High jump kick, okay. Yes! Nautil can learn it! Wait, so can Fong. So can Ardeus. So can Stu. We're giving it to Nautil. Yeah! You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and use TM30 also, because it's Peck, and that's... While it's not a terrible move, it's not a great move. It'll give me some type diversity, and get some space in the bag so that'll be good pulling a big job here what what if I am lost how is me getting lost supposed to help you get your job done faster you just gotta help me find my parents I mean and they're in another town so that is not gonna be an easy thing to do I feel like I should not be staying in with Ardeus right now okay okay now, if that's what it's gonna use, should be fine. Oh, I'm getting really nervous about this. Yes! Alright. Good job, Ardeus. Level 11, alright. And a Jolteon. I don't want to send mine out. Um, let's see. Gonna go with Pong. Should be alright. Well, yeah, mine was 11, so... <clears throat> and asleep, so... Excuse me. Would not have had the advantage in this situation. Let's try Razor Leaf, see what this does. Wish -a! Critical hit, and it did less than Body Slam, so... That is good to you now. Uh, yeah, I'm good. I'm the future champ how this game works. Oh, Pokeball! Nice! How many Pokeballs do I have, by the way? Five. With that one. I didn't even move! How did you attack me when I didn't even move? Nope, 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 nope. Um... Yeah, we'll go out to Noddle. You know, this tangle is kind of growing on me. I, I'm actually enjoying raising it. Uh, not right now, actually. Because that did nothing. Wow. I thought that was going to be like some serious damage, but it did nothing. That's crazy. Whoa, Creeper with Slash. It's actually, sorry. Awesome. Yay, only 12 more levels till a new move. No. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm gonna start running. 
only got so much time in these episodes, so I'm going to go heal. Maybe go buy some repels. There was an ivy sore in here. You explode too. Yeah, you know I'm gonna kill that. Um. Substitute, okay. There should be some good points, it'll be worth it. That's right! I broke that substitute. Normally I do try to raise the team evenly. But in the beginning like this, did I go to the wrong... No, okay, I'm good. Gold bag. Not a mind having one of those. Hmm. Let's try it. See what happens. Oh, I really thought that was gonna kill. This one should though. But earlier on in the games, I just feel more comfortable having one that's a bit higher level. Well, at least in a Nuzlocke, if it's just a regular one, then yeah, it's definitely raising them evenly. You know what? I'm just running. I'm not dealing with an exploding Charmeleon. That way, in case something happens, I've got a higher level to hopefully make sure that I don't lose the entire Nuzlocke if things start going badly. Not giving me the Charmeleons. There's joy, I'm back. Here I'm a Pokemon. Yeah. Thank you, Nurse Joy. Doozy up front. I can get repels in that first. Or not first town, but Pewter City, right? I hope so, because I'm going back there to get some. I'm getting through Mount Moon today. I would like to beat Nugget Bridge as well. And I have about... 29 minutes to do all that. Keep getting all those wild encounters. It's going to take a little bit extra. No, they do not have repels. Bad store owner. Or worker, whatever you are. That is so bad of you. Ah, I feel like... Well, I mean, the potions could be helpful, but that's not good. I just wasted some time coming back here. Oh, well. No, why did I... Ah, and then I walked into the grass. That was me. That was my bad. I just did not click the other button fast enough. How do you miss a water gun? Come on now. Don't be a doozy doozy. Aw, oh, I was supposed to take it out. I'm starting to wonder if I want a Flareon because I didn't have any attacking moves at the time. I think all Pokemon, whenever you start them off with randomized moves, have an attack. Pretty sure they have at least one move that can damage. Oh my gosh, how bad would it be to get a Pokemon with one move and their one move is something like explosion or self-destruct. That's never happened to me before, but if that's happened to you, leave a comment, let me know about it, because that would be awful. And how did you manage to survive if you did? Or did you just reset and start over again? I honestly wouldn't blame you if you did. 
I would try to make it work somehow, but it, it probably wouldn't go very far. Critical hit, yeah. Doozy to 12. Oh, yeah. Booyah! Okay, 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 okay. Gotta get through this cave. Ah, I can't believe they didn't have repels. Bring it. What you got, kid? No, I didn't come to explore. I came to make it through. Oh no, it's another swimmer. Now he's swimming in caves. Already got new Pokemon. He must be breaking the Nuzlocke rules. You definitely didn't go to any new areas. Where are these kids following us? At least he's not talking to me about shorts anymore. Gold duck. Bite you two. That did not do much damage. Wait a minute, I need to be paying attention to how much damage that's doing. That's a critical hit. You're gonna rest. Okay, yep. Now I'm the one using rest. So much nicer when I'm doing it. How it took me down so much. Listen to Weeping Bell. I need to wake up and pay attention because otherwise I'm gonna end up losing someone. And that would be bad. It would be the first death of the series. And I'm actually doing really good to have no deaths at this point. Like, surprisingly well. I've normally lost two or three Pokemon by now. Um, yeah, we're just gonna switch out. Switch out to not. Mega kick, huh? Going with confusion. Oh my goodness. Cubone, you need to calm it down with that. No fire blast for you. Unless it's on Fong. You can fire blast Fong. But nobody else. And Doozy is no longer paralyzed. Alright, team's getting up there a little bit. Oh my goodness. So many encounters. There's Ponitas in here. I would have taken a Ponita. I would have. Then there. Oh my gosh, come on. Meowth would have been alright. I do like Meowth. It's just not the strongest, special. Okay. Uh, I will be battling all trainers as well because that experience is very valuable going into the Elite Four. Shocked you. Maybe I was dragging my feet a little bit. I don't remember poking you though. And he has a full-blown Charizard. That is not good. I hope this thing does not have explosion as well. That would be even... Oh my gosh, it's got explosion. No, Ardeus! Oh my gosh, Ardeus lived! How? I'm not complaining, but how did you live in explosion? Yes! Ardeus is a lot more tanky than I thought. 
Oh my gosh. That is twice so far in this episode that I thought I was going to lose our dais. And almost did. Stop hitting the egg bomb. I don't want to lose Stu either. I don't want to lose anybody. I love them all. Ooh, 013 Stu. And a Machamp. Okay. Bottle, you're up. Wait a minute. Doesn't this thing have, like, Ice Punch? I remember this. Because it gave me trouble in Route 1. It doesn't matter. You're down. You're dead. Dead. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. That's right, I'm tough. I'm the man. I'm the kid man. I'm the man kid. I'm the man key. There's Kabu Tops! That would have been awesome. Mm, I'm gonna use... Oh, I could have sold my Max Revive. I mean, I can't use it, so... Might as well get something out of it. If it is worth zero, like the other items, I'm not gonna be happy. If you know why those items were worth zero in the other episodes, let me know in the comments. I... There was a Mew in here! Not dealing with that! Oh, there was a Mew! I want a Mew. Why am I getting so many encounters? Come on. I thought there was an item up there. There's not. Little kids leave grown-ups alone. How would they get fed? How would they get through their lives and learn how to be adults? Anyone else notice that Jigglypuff's mouth is like a triangle? Whoa, 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 level 16. Okay, no, no, no. Um, I think Fong can handle this. Yeah, she's got like a little upside down triangle going on there. No, why would your stun spore miss? Hit. Okay, okay. No, 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 no. Fong, you've been doing awesome. Do not start this now. Now body slam. Alright, Jigglypuff paralyzed. And has a useless move. Backsplash. Fong level 14. Well, maybe you should have been stir fried instead. Instead of steamed. I did not switch those at all, did I? It's okay. Once I looked at it, I didn't need to. Oh my goodness. Omanite. Omanite slow poke. PG Arbok, that's all, folks. Nope, nope. Wasting time. On a time limit here, I need to not deal with Anita Queen. And that would be some good points. But still got trainers to deal with too. Oh my gosh, I'm getting like three steps. Come on, what is going on here? Is it because I'm not fighting him? Well, get over it, because I'm not doing it. I really wish that Mart had repels, because this is getting ridiculous. Ah, now he's left of us. There's some really good Pokemon in here. What I end up with? Oh yeah, I got my Jolteon, okay. Doozy. That one's okay. I'm okay with the Jolteon. I mean, the other ones could have terrible moves. I mean, Charizard and Charmeleon had Explosion. That is terrible. Why would you want to move like that in a Nuzlocke? That's a guaranteed death. I do not remember what Kakuna had. By the way, if you missed episodes 1, 2, or 3, go back and watch those. Exciting times. Or at least fun times. <clears throat> Victory bell. 
I feel like this is scary, so I'm gonna switch out. My memory is not the best, so when it comes to remembering what has what moves, I may have to rely on you guys. Because I'm just not very good at it, and I've done a lot of these, so I may mix up ones that I've done. Oh! Nice! I danced to level 14. That's right, Fisher. Oh, so that's what that is. Okay, now it makes sense. It's not a whip, it's a fishing pole. That's what's going on. Ah, it all makes sense now. Because he's, he's not a rocket guy that whips Pokemon, he's a fisherman that like catches Pokemon. Ha ha! Felt like there should be an item over there. And there was. Alright, you. I'm taking a fossil. Don't be greedy. Tell you what, he doesn't look like a very strong man. But, I'll take your word for it. Maybe we should arm wrestle. Find out who's stronger. I think I might be able to take him. Nice. Having more. Whoa, what are you doing? What are you doing? No. No, no, no. No solar beams on stew. Darn it. Who's Gas gonna learn another move? I should have checked that too. Should be able to take this pretty easy. Yeah. That may be the only move Jinx has right now. Nah, she probably got two. When are you going to learn a new move, Gas? Your move set is not the greatest. And a weeping bell. Once you get the fossil, it should be almost out of the cave. So we're gonna make through Mount Moon today. And probably take on the rival. And start Nugget Bridge. We have 18 Noddle. Only 11 more levels to go to learn a new move. I'll go with the Helix Fossil. I mean, they're going to be randomized, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> Could get a Metapod out of this. Could get an Aerodactyl. Could get a Moltres. That would be awesome. I would definitely like a Moltre. Come on! What is the encounter rate in this cave? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. No. No. You calm. No. 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 Okay. Okay. No, no, no. We're not doing this. Stu did not survive all of this to go down now. Electabuzz, you need to calm your crap down. You need to calm your crud down. Yeah, that's what I meant. Nobody up here. Nobody! Is there anything? Nope. And it's been a little bit since you played something, it never hurts to check an area to make sure you don't miss anything. Especially since you can't come back to this area until you get... Fly or... S yeah, because then you can go back to Pewter City and go back through the cave, which... I do not plan on doing. Or I guess you could do Surf. Oh, there we go. TM48. What do we got here? 
think normally that's spike cannon. Okay. All right, I can work with that. Um, 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 uh, gonna give this to Bong. I know I'm gonna get 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 some flack in the comments, but I am getting rid of Skull Bash, and you are learning Spike Cannon. It's it really is just a more useful move. I just really don't like two turn moves. Now, Solar Beam is a little different. I do like to get that one. Like with something like a Venusaur or Victory Bell, Vile Plume. But I like to combine it with Sleep Powder, so I'm guaranteed to be able to hit them with it. Not, not guaranteed to hit, but guaranteed to have the opportunity to hit. We made it to Cerulean City! Yeah! There's a hidden item back here somewhere. I don't know if you can hear me pushing my keyboard buttons. There it is! Oh, it's a protein! Yes! Okay, now that's good. We just got a buttload more money. And I'm gonna go to the mart and sell it and get the more money. So far the TMs have actually been helpful. Not been super helpful, but they have been helpful. Alright, 2000 for the match revive. Good, good, good. Can't sell that. And almost 5,000 for that. Oh my goodness, repels! I'm gonna buy 10 of those. <laughs> or when I have to deal with another place. That hey, you guys know where I'm talking about already. Buy some more potions. Buy a bunch of Pokeballs. Right, we're looking good now. Did I go and heal yet? I did. Okay, good. I forgot to say hi to Nurse Joy. She's probably all sad now. Hi, Nurse Joy. Don't worry, I don't need healed yet. I'm just gonna deposit some items so I don't get full in my bag. Because that's a thing back in the original gens. It is a real thing. And it is a very annoying thing. Not only can you fill the bag that you carry items around with you in, but you can fill your PC with items. And then you just have to get rid of stuff. Use it or whatever. Oh no, oh no, I almost forgot about the rival battle. Okay. Okay, we got this. My butt. Yo, Pyro! You're still struggling along, along back here. Doing great. Got a bunch of strong, smart Pokemon. Let me show you what I caught. Alright, let's see what my butt caught. It's got four Pokemon. Got a Haunter. Okay, okay. Level 18. That's scary. That's very scary, actually. Alright, Noddle. You're up. Okay, Bubble Beam. Good, good. That's not... I haven't got a critical hit. No, don't do that. What are you doing? Are you doing Sky Attack? That did not do as much damage as I was hoping. Body Slam on effect. Oh no, this is bad. This is very, very bad. What do you have? Bite was a normal type move back in this, so that's not going to affect Haunter. Let's see what a rock throw does. Okay, it's going to miss. Uh, 
Oh man, this is pretty scary. Okay. Wait, why did I do that? Why would I do that? Should have taken that opportunity to use rest. Come on, what's wrong with me? Oh, I really need to wake up or I am going to lose somebody. No, why is Bubble Do Beam doing so... And why you keep missing... I know it doesn't have very great accuracy. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Survive, survive, survive. No! Come on, really? Of all the ones to lose, Doozy... That bubble beam should not have done that much damage. <sighs> well, the streak is broken. Block is dead. It, 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 it's not worth going on anymore. Doozy is down. No! Come on! Alright, alright, alright. No, 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 no. That's enough of this. You are not pulling this on me. You are not wiping out my team. I am not being left with him some. Yeah, how do you like added effects happening to you? Big meanie. Poor doozy. I'm so sad. I mean, there, there were so many others that would have been okay to lose. I'm sorry if that offended you guys to, to know that you were expendable, but there were some. But not Doozy. Doozy was not one of them. Fong is not one of them. It's a Caterpie? totally ruined my type diversity. Now I have to get through all those trainers just to try and get another encounter. Well, there's actually two encounters I can get up there. That's right, I beat my butt! Don't you forget that! That was for Doozy! Monster! I don't even care what you had to say. Go away. You're talking to me. I have to go get rid of Doozy. This is a sad day in Pokemon history. Doozy, you were awesome for the short time that I had you. You were a Jolteon, and you you beat some Pokemon. Thank you for thank you for sharing those experiences with us. I'm gonna miss you. I'm not gonna whip, get out dim sum. Maybe if something happens to another one, but for now, that it, I'm just gonna see what the encounters are. Down to the two and a half minute mark. Okay, moving on. Maybe I was a little under leveled going into that. I maybe should have started with Noddle. Might have been the better choice. All right, we're gonna get to start Nugget Bridge. He has five trainers, you mean six. No, wait, you do get the Nugget for beating five, but then the other guy battles you anyways, because he's a meanie. And he doesn't even listen to you trying to say, yes, I wanna join Team Rocket and be a fisherman too. What do you have? Try it. Wow, oh, that did more damage than I thought it was gonna do. That did not do as much damage as I thought it was going to do. 
is kind of reversing. It's reversing the fortune. No. Oh, oh yeah, there we go. There we go. Yeah. Go on this. The fifteen. And has a sand shrew. We know what it's got. Should have Fire Blast and Tackle. Hopefully we won't have to see any of those because this Razor Leaf will take it out. There we go. Yeah! Long level 15. Yeah! Man, you bug... Okay, you know what? Maybe you bug catchers aren't so great. I was defending you earlier. When some guy was calling you not serious Pokemon trainers, but you got, you guys have like no money, and that's yeah. But, uh, it's just it's just sad. Okay, well, I started my timer a little bit late, so probably already at the 40 minute mark, and I just didn't realize it yet. So I'm gonna go ahead and wrap things up here. Did make it through Mount Moon and beat the rivals. We lost. We lost Doozy. Which is very sad. I may go cry a little afterwards. But, started Nugget Bridge. And next episode, going to finish Nugget Bridge. Go for the second gym badge and see what happens from there. So, this is Mr. Houndoomer. Thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed, like, comment, and subscribe. Join me for the next episode. And I will see you next time. Thanks much.